Hello my soul, welcome to a new reading. This is a love reading. The message is going to be in regards of your love life. A situation that you are dealing with right now. A person that acts maybe a little bit weird around you. You want to know why they act this way. What's happening uh, with this person? Um, let's see their thoughts, feelings and future actions towards you and where this is going with this person. So let's see their thoughts towards you, my dear viewer. And their feelings. This can be uh, can be very connected, right? Their uh, future actions and what's coming, what's going to be with this with this connection. Okay. Now, let's take the first card. Okay. So, the person that we are talking about here, their thoughts, let's see their feelings also, hmm, towards you is that They want to stop this. And as you can see here, so we have toxic story. This person feels like, almost like this is a punishment for them. The connection um, that is in between the two of you. They don't like how things are going. What they are, their thoughts are uh, thinking of getting away. You know, maybe they consider you too mature, you know. Uh, it's like you are not on the same level in some way. Let's see more. You know, so it's something about you that makes them uh, to look somewhere else. Uh, they feel like they are not uh, at your level, you know. It's a weird feeling here, whoever this person is. You see, there is a great connection in the same time, but they feel that there is something that is just not adding up to this connection. You know? So, even though they have these thoughts, now that I'm looking better at your cards, you know, uh, this person may be someone who, uh, like you are a different type of a person that they've been... Um, they've been with until now you know and they don't know how to deal with this because you have so much to offer and they feel like you know they better stop it before before it starts so their thoughts sometimes are like to run away from you because they don't know how to deal with someone so uh, confident um, you you are like looking for this person like you have your thing together you know and they don't know how to how to act with this what to do with this so but look at this mm, besides or despite their thoughts right their doubts and all these negativities that they tell to themselves their future actions here are to talk with you you know they will some of you you will hear from this person they will really tell you how they think like uh, they are not at your level and they are scared about this but you see with the soulmate here there is so much attraction in between the two of you so it's quite hard to to give up on this you know uh, despite of how he or she is feeling they don't feel that they are at your level but also um, even though they feel this way they will not uh, they will not run away you know so this is someone who wants to come around you that wants to um that is thinking about you a lot and uh, they will um 
you know, this is a person who needs a lot of insurance, guarantee. They want to see uh, because they have a lot of, um, of uh, self-doubt and this lack uh, uh, of self-confidence. And this is someone that uh, it's you can be with them. This can uh, become a long-term relationship, but it will require quite a lot of effort. This is um, one thing that I uh, strongly get for you here. It's a great connection, that, but requires a lot of, uh, you know, work because uh, this person is not that uh, sure on, you know, their ability to be in a connection with someone so confident and um, so amazing as you are. So let's see a little bit more. Now, there is the wedding card. This person might be scared of the idea of commitment. Look at this. Because they think, maybe you know better what you think, but they think that you want marriage, you want, look at this wedding and engagement for their thoughts and feelings. This is something that is really, um, you know, there on their mind, like how they going to do this? Because they have this low self-esteem. They don't believe that they've got what it takes. And um, it's, it, it's this fear of not being able to, you know, to to deal with something so serious because they strongly believe that your, um, let's say your goal, right? Um, your dream is to be married, to create a family, to have all these things, serious stuff, right? And this person has all these issues and insecurities and that is why it's so hard for them to, um, you know, to kind of deal with you you know that's why it they may seem uh, sometimes very cold you may feel like you have to um you really have to uh push them to do certain things because they don't know how to deal with a person as you are maybe they never been in a serious relationship or with someone who really is looking forward for more so that's something that is really scared them but look at this it's it's so much attraction in between the two of you what a, a magnetism in between you and this person we have the love call soulmate great connection and the attraction card so you know, it's hard to say no to this. It's hard to run away from this. So I don't feel like this person will um, will run uh, or will be cold for too long because um, they have their eyes on you. Their heart is with you. And um, for some of you, maybe things are a little bit, a little bit complicated. This can be that maybe you have children, maybe they have children, um, because we have the children car here. So this can, let's say, make things a little bit more complicated, but not impossible. Also, the, with the children car here can be that um, uh, this uh, child-like uh, attitude, you know, um, they, um, they, will have even in the future moments when you feel like you are dealing with a child and this is because um, this person doesn't know how to you know how to act how to take all the all these serious things that are coming uh, when it comes to your relationship with them so let's see what else we can find out about this person in your mind this person that you are dealing with, they are really acting, uh, they really um, put you on thinking, right? Like, what's going on with this person? Why they are like this? So, you see, there is the child card again, showing us that this might be, um, they are thinking of making a small step forward towards you, you know? It's, it's small. They, they, this might be a person who 
likes to make a lot of jokes and having this kind of attitude is like a you know a defensive uh, mode they are in defensive mode they don't know how to how to react or how to deal with um, especially how to talk with you so they might do a lot of jokes um, uh, exactly because they don't know how to be around you you know they are um, their insecurities are their biggest uh, blockage now we also see the ship card here which is showing that there is a new adventure this person definitely will um, do something you know there is going to be communication uh, they will let you know about their thoughts about their plans when it comes to this connection with you you will hear from them definitely and uh, the last card here is the snake showing that um, uh, in between you and this person um, there is you know in the future what will keep it together this um, desire for one another great great desire here and chemistry in between you and this person it's like let's say when if something bad will happen in between the two of you you won't be able to stay away from each other for too long there is um, a great desire here that will not allow you to be too long ap apart okay now let me grab some advice for you i'm not sure what should i choose what should i choose let's take i have some cards here okay let's take this deck i've been using it today let's see for you my dear viewer some advice give your inner critic a vacation be kind to yourself you have find ways to lighten up and not take everything so seriously so you see you are giving way too much energy and time thinking about why they act this way why they said that why they did that why they don't do that um don't be that serious about this don't waste too much energy on this because this person is someone who needs to figure things out is someone who needs to find their courage to step forward to um to take some action towards you so with the love call here um definitely is nothing that you can do about it it's there what they are going to do what is their intention and their intention is to come towards you to talk with you so what you can do is to um, give yourself a break you know give yourself a break they will come they, they will come look at this focus on uh, whatever you have on your plate right now whatever you need to deal with because this person will come around that's definitely um, they you are going to hear from them all right so my dear viewer, these are the messages for you. I really hope you enjoyed the reading and uh, hopefully it was helpful. I wish you best of luck in your love life. May all the things to go just the way you need. Um, and take care of yourself. Until next time, all the best. Bye.